Western Magnesium is setting up shop with a 122-acre plant adjacent to the Harrison County Airport to create magnesium. Their president and CEO, Sam Atias, said they spent 16 months scouting out the right location. We really felt that, that this was the right area for us. We had the right people, the right area to work with, so out of everything we've looked at, this was the right place to start. Magnesium is used for the automotive and aviation industries because of its hard and durable characteristics. Congressman Bill Johnson stressed the importance of creating the metal in the United States. Part of this effort is to bring back that supply chain uh, with a critical mineral like uh, uh, metal like magnesium. Today, China holds about 85 percent of that market. We need to be back in that market. I'm glad to see what's happening here. It will be used for U.S. industry and defense, so he said it's important for us to be self-sufficient. We need to be able to harvest magnesium, and we don't need to be held uh, hostage by China to get it either. This will not only help U.S. businesses, but will greatly benefit Harrison County as well. We're going to be bringing 200 jobs, permanent jobs for Harrison County. There will be several hundred temporary jobs in the construction phase. Harrison County Community Impact Corporation President Dale Arbaugh said it will help them diversify their portfolio. The oil and gas has done great for the county. We've had a lot of infrastructure come from it. It's time to build on to that and add more diversification. He said he wants to do so as a safeguard in case anything happens to either the oil or gas industries. I want something else to keep us going instead of being all reliant on one industry. One area where some corporations fall short is their environmental footprint, but Atiyah says they have already figured that out. We're zero waste and close to zero toxicity, and that's something that we're very proud of. In Harrison County, I'm Aaron Myler for 7 News, working for you.